So myself is Dr. Pradeep Kumar Goswami. I'm a consultant gynecologist and obstetrician and a subspecialist in fetal and maternal medicine. I'm the founder and director of Fitomat Foundation and the lead consultant in this team. Fetal echocardiography is the special assessment of the baby's heart inside the mother's uterus. Normally when you do the anatomy or anomaly scan, a uh, detailed look in the heart has already taken place uh, and most of the cases if there is any major abnormality, uh, it should have been picked up, you know. However, fetal echocardiography is a further detailed assessment of the fetal heart which is usually done by a, a pediatric cardiologist or a specially trained fetal medicine uh, person, you know, fetal medicine doctor, which goes beyond the standard assessment of the fetal heart and goes further detailed assessment of the uh, baby's heart in terms of heart size, heart function, heart blood flow uh, and, uh, and gives uh, us a report more detailed than a normal assessment of the fetal heart at anatomy or anomaly scan. Now this is indicated in cases where it is perceived to be high risk of having a cardiac problem, something like if the mother have a medical problem like diabetes, if a previous baby had a cardiac problem, a family history of certain genetic syndromes and IVF pregnancies in particular thought to be at higher risk of cardiac problems, the twin or multiple pregnancies and the list goes on you know. And also in otherwise normal pregnancies, the parents can opt for it for a detailed assessment of the fetal heart. It is done at around 24 weeks of pregnancy, uh, sort of about uh, 6 months of the pregnancy. Uh, it takes longer time than the normal uh, anatomy or anomaly scan and sometimes re-examinations may be necessary. And as I said earlier, that normal detection rate of a cardiac problem is about 60% through normal scan, through fetal echocardiography, obviously the detection rate of a major problem should be as close to as 90%.